If I hear that song one more time. So this video is my March favorites video, but I decided to keep my products down to a minimum because let's face it, this month there's been so many trending topics that I just can't even deal. Like I cannot cope with this. So I have very few products but very much gossip. This month I tried to get the Revlon look and I went and I got Revlon Nearly Naked um, Press Powder in the color 40 Medium Deep and it's really good. Like I like it a lot, especially like the little thing it comes in. Like the little thing. Look at that. Like. I mean, this is cute. Usually they do the round ones, but I liked how this one was more fluffy. And then the next thing I got for Revlon is um, just some blush, and this is in the color 2 Hot Pink Rose Class. And I mean, I'm wearing it right now, and I think it's just like really good on my skin tone. I like bright blushes, you know, so that you know I'm wearing blush. So thought this was a really good color. I just don't do a favorites video without food and this month's favorite food is donuts! Like oh my god. Let me eat some of this real quick. Hang on. So good. Okay. Basically this month I've been all about that donut life. All about that donut life. Like I cannot even tell you how many donuts I've had this month and there's so many stories about donuts for this month. Like one of them was, I got my blood drawn for the first time ever in my life this month, and I told my mom, like, you're gonna make this up to me by getting me a donut and some apple juice, and she did. And then I argued with this kid for the longest time. He wanted to borrow a dollar, but his friend owed me a donut that his friend never got me, so I was like, listen, if you want a dollar, you're gonna get me a donut. So he ended up getting me two donuts and like a dozen donut holes, like my life was made. First trending topic of the month, which there's so many so I can't cope and I don't even know where to begin. I'm about to ruin your childhood because you know Kirby the police officer from The Sweet Life on Deck? Yeah, okay. He died this month and I don't know when or how or why but he died and, you know, Debbie Ryan, Cole and Dylan Sprouse, you know, Brenda Song, all of them, they were on Twitter, you know, with the hashtag Rip Kirby, and so many people were sad, like, that's sad. Okay, so, you know, that happened. Zayn Malik, I don't care if it's Malik, I say Malik, he left One Direction, but then their manager called me and they wanted me to be a part of the band. So now I'm chained by day and Jerome by night. <laughs> that is like the worst Photoshop picture ever. Okay, 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 I'm sorry. I should be more sensitive to this situation because I understand so many Directioners are really sad about this and I understand why. Honestly, I feel like it's okay to cry and be upset about this. There was a time when Zayn was my favorite in the, like, in the One Direction group, although I'm not like a big, big fan. I feel like if you are a true Directioner, you would like, you're gonna be sad about it. Because, you know, I would be sad if somebody I really liked quit singing and stuff. But you would be happy for Zayn and you wouldn't be like, how could you do this, Zayn? How do you guys know that Zayn won't come back in like a year or two? Or how do you know Zayn won't go solo? You guys are taking this way too far. I could just ramble on forever. It was his choice and I don't think we know, like how annoying it is to always have people taking pictures of us, people yelling and screaming our names all the time, blowing up our phones, blowing up our social media. I don't think we know how annoying that is. He did a lot for a long time, and it, if it's messing up his personal life, 
he needs to go and I respect him for doing that because you know if he didn't do it now could you imagine what would have happened if he if he stayed there unhappy for like more months or more years like how bad that would have been I guess we just need to support him and he may come back he may get his own solo label and that's kind of how I feel about that. So that was my video for my monthly favorites and trending topics this month. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I love you guys so much and yeah, see you guys soon!